Hey guys, Claude Diamond here with a pretty good gut sales tip. Um, I'm always trying to draw these topics from my life experiences. Did you ever have to deal with a bully in school or at work or just in business? This overpowering personality that talks over you, talks louder than you, is always right, is not willing to listen. Listening can make you a lot of money, by the way. Today, I had an experience, a business experience, kind of, um, with a bully. Haven't had one, you know? I, man, I want to get along with everybody, you know? Uh, I don't want to, I don't like contentious arguments. But this bully came up to me in an aggressive manner, yelled at me, was very hysterical. And I'm a student of psychology. The gut sales method is based on human behavior. I've read a lot of books on psychology. i show you a few here. Psychology of Winning, great book, Dr. Whiteley. Ayn Rand, love this woman. Capitalism was what she talked about, how anybody can make it in this wonderful country if they have the fortitude, the focus, and the hard work and are not looking for excuses. Um, I have my regular uh, psychology books here. These have helped me a lot. I've always wanted to study why human behavior, why should someone buy from me is the question I ask every day. And Dr. Byrne, who I'm going to talk about, a lot of the gut sales method is based on this genius man from Canada, a psychologist from the 60s, Dr. Eric Byrne. He wrote the famous book, Games People Play. So why does a bully act like a bully? Well, a lot of times they got away with it most of their life. No one ever stood up to them. The real important thing with a bully in business, particularly when you get that person who won't listen to you, is to not get caught up in their psychological baggage. If they're hysterical, you remain calm. If they talk loud, you talk softer. If, if they are uh, impolite and abusive and aggressive, you, become, you don't rise up to their level because that just exacerbates it. Dr. Byrne, who I base the guts sales method on, the guts has made me a lot of money. It makes my students a lot of money because we ask ourselves, why do people play these games? Why do they do what they do? Dr. Byrne took a very complicated area of psychology and he said, we have basically three ego states. Sometimes we're the child. The child can be very emotional, very immature, very inexperienced. We all know children and how they behave in different uh, uncomfortable situations in the supermarket or a toy store, or they're just hysterical to get what they want from people. Bullies are sometimes like that, by the way. Sometimes we're the parent role. Parents can be very emotional too. Um, they can be very loving, um, very nurturing. We've all had, hopefully, a mom or a dad who was there to comfort us during a bad time, a bad day. And then we also have that critical parent who could be very abusive and very overwhelming. Then we have, and that's also an emotional state too. And then sometimes we can be the adult. He said, these, the adult is non-emotional. The adult is cognitive, intellectual. The adult is the super or uber man. The adult thinks things through. The, the adult hauls themselves back from getting emotional. So when you're dealing with a bully in business, you don't get emotional. You stay intellectual. You don't rise to their bad behavior or their hysterical activity and verbiage. You stay calm and you keep in control. And even when they get the last word, you're the one who won because you didn't get caught up in their part. In my language, bullshit. You're the one who won because you were the adult in the room. You were the doctor. You were the intellectual. Let them, let them do what they want. There's a line, I know, and sometimes bullies cross that line when it gets physical or totally abusive, and that's when you stand up for yourself. That's something else. That's another discussion for another time. But in business, when you get that personality, hit them with logic. Hit them with reason. And and that's why you become the winner in that conversation with that bully. This is Claude Diamond with a way too long video. I hope these little things help you guys. These are the experiences I go through. I want you to have a good life because nobody, and I mean this from my heart and soul, nobody deserves success more than you guys. I know how hard you work and how well-meaning you are. Okay, and I do answer my own phone, 970-281-5151, or pull me up on Skype, Claude Diamond, or click the subscribe button if, you, if this is in YouTube, and um, hopefully some of these ideas and things I share with you will make life easier, business more prosperous, prosperous and keep you happy. Take care.